One of the more recent additions to the Orion platform is what we call modern dashboards. It's a way you can have dynamic information in there and unlike our classic dashboards, modern dashboards can be edited by anyone who has access to the Orion console. They're fairly easy to build, but sometimes you need a little bit of inspiration. So we actually have a content exchange up on Thwack where you can download ones that other community members have built and put right into your system. It takes a little bit of finesse and I'll show you how to do that right now. So if we go to Thwack under the content exchange and under Orion platform, we have modern dashboards. So let's go ahead and jump in. Let's say there's a specific dashboard you're looking for. You can search by tag or you can just search in the search bar. Today, we're just going to grab one at random. So let's say we have the overall node status dashboard. If we look at that. Here's a picture of what it looks like. Okay. I think that's the one for us. Let's go ahead and grab this overall node status dashboard. So we'll just go ahead and download it. That JSON file we just downloaded contains the entire definition all of the widgets, all of the colors, all of the icons. And it's ready for use right now. But we need to import it into our Orion system. And you can either do that in one of two ways. You can use Swickle Studio, or the way I prefer is I'm going to use PowerShell to pull it in. In our public GitHub repository for the Orion SDK, we already have a sample that actually includes the import and export functionality. So you can just go to Samples, PowerShell, Functions, and then Download Function Modern Dashboards and just save it somewhere on your computer. We're in PowerShell. Let's validate that we actually have the necessary module. So we're going to do get module, name, Swiss PowerShell, list available. There we go. We've got it. Version 3.1.0. Perfect. We need at least version 3 for this. So now we can import those functions. We'll do that with a period and then the path to the PS1 file that we downloaded. This is typically called dot including. Since it's in the same folder here, I can just start typing the name and use tab completion. And to validate that we have those functions now available for us, we can do get command dash name star dashboard star. There we go. We have an import and an export function. So let's import that JSON file that we just set up. For this, we'll need to connect to the SolarWinds information service. To import that JSON file into a modern dashboard, we need to start by building a connection to the Orion server from PowerShell. So we will build a Swiss connection. And the command to build that is connect Swiss. The host name. And the credential set. You can also use dash username and dash password, but I'm going to use the get credential. Okay, no errors. So our Swiss connection has been built. So then if we want to import a modern dashboard, the command is import modern dashboard, followed by the Swiss connection, and then the path to the file, and hit enter. In this case, it's asking if we want to do this. Yes, I do. There we go. The file has been imported. So then if you go to manage dashboards and hit modern, there it is overall status breakdown and we can click on it, explore it and edit it if we like. Working with the API may seem intimidating at first, but it's really not that difficult and we want to make it easier for you, which is why we've provided samples, including this one that can handle importing and exporting of modern dashboards. In fact, let's export one we already have. This node availability modern dashboard is something that I built and I think other people could benefit from it. So all you need to export this, is the ID that ID is at the end of the URL in this case 16 we can go back to the same prompt we used and this time use export modern dashboard Swiss connection the variable we're using for the Swiss connection the dashboard ID and the ID number Hit enter it doesn't look like it did anything but if I look in this folder, there it is, node availability. To share that, we can just jump over to Thwack, go to Modern Dashboards, hit Create. 
browse for the file. Give it a name. And describe it real fast. Include a screenshot so people know what they're getting. Include the platform level where we've tested this. Any products we're using and anything to help people find it. And that's it. And then post. Now that modern dashboard that you took the time to build is available for everyone else to use on their systems. What I like about that is, although modern dashboards are relatively new, they can be very complex and talking someone through all the nuances of it is a little difficult. That's why being able to share this stuff on the Thwack Content Exchange is a great way to get people to start working with it in their environment and a great way for you to explore on your own.